The Great War is over. All we want is to return home. To the new republic, born in the heart of Europe. But we are stuck as the escalating civil war blocks the direct path to the west. The only way out is to the east, through territory disputed between the red and white armies. We have to take an armored train across Siberia and then safe passage home by ship. It is our only chance to survive this long journey. It might be our last train home. Hello, hello. I hope you're feeling awesome today. In this video, I would like to cover Last Train Home. Um, it's an RTS management hybrid where you have a jolly band of soldiers from the Czech Republic or Czechoslovakia trying to return home during the Great War getting stuck in between the Russian Revolution and it's a bit of a fiction fictive work but also it's kind of realistic somewhat because that stuff really happened um, let's not talk too much jump right into the game it's also one of the games I was really looking forward to and have wishlisted for quite some time um, you got different options basically as presets for your play um, I think it's not one of these games that's super easy to complete. You might maybe even call it a roguelite. Well, roguelite is not correct as you don't make any progress in between, but um, it's hard. Let's just say I think this game is hard. Probably is. I haven't played it yet, so I cannot really judge it, but I think it will be hard. Um, okay, uh, to, the, to the difficulty options, you got basically certain presets that you can choose from. Um, you got the road trip, which makes it rather easily tactician when you just want to focus on the fighting. Uh, Quartermaster, where you want to less focus on the fighting and more on just management of your troops and the machine itself. Or Commander, the full mode, which I would recommend. And the game also does recommend. As you probably would want to have the full experience. But that depends on, obviously, the type of person you are and what you enjoy. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to leave it as is. Because I have no clue. During the Great War, later known as World War I, the Czechoslovak Legion was commissioned to fight on Russia's behalf in exchange for support for an independent Czechoslovak Republic. However, the Great War exacted tremendous loss of life and economic collapse in Russia, igniting a revolution that deposed the Tsar and devolved into a bloody civil war. The Bolsheviks established the Red Army to consolidate power and rule over a united Russia, whereas the White Army rallied to oppose the Reds. The Czechoslovak Legion was now in a very delicate position, an armed force in a foreign land with no clear allegiance to the Reds or Whites. Moreover, Russia's western borders were still held by powers opposing the establishment of Czechoslovakia. Thus, the Czechoslovak Provisional Government ordered the legionaries to remain neutral and travel eastward to Vladivostok to board ships back to Europe. Nonetheless, during its evacuation via the Trans-Siberian Railway, the legion became embroiled in armed conflicts affecting the course of the Russian Civil War. Now, we learn the story of the last train home, a work of fiction inspired by the writings of a brilliant member of the Czechoslovak Legion and a veritable instrument of history. The story begins with an ambitious captain under the command of Major Gazdik, who leads the last unit of Czechoslovak legionaries, headed to Vladivostok by armored train. Cheer up, Captain. The train needs a checkup, and we can be on our way. I heard you bragged you'd be a better major than I am. So, let's see how well you do in command. Let's take a squad and go trade with the local miller, while the rest of the legionaries look after the train. Visually, this looks pretty appealing. Okay, let's see. Mm -hmm. Yes, Controls. sir! Huh. Feels pretty good. 
very responsive yes. unit. We got the company of heroes like interface. This is all very good. I smell smoke. That's not good. No, this is good. I like Those that. Are destroyed. <laughs> Fortunately, it seems nobody was around to get hurt. Hurry and collect the sacks with food supplies before they burn too. Let's hope it's good. Okay, we also got our I'll pry looting. It open then. That's also pretty just right clicking. Well, the controls feel very great. Winter so that overall right or directly burn feels very right. Mill. Assuming position. We have to talk to the miller. The farmhouse is nearby. Let's go. Understood. As you say, sir. Well, there's even stuff to discover on the maps. Nice. Yes. I'm not like 100% sure what to expect from this game, like mentioned in other videos before. I'm not spoiling myself on games that I'm actually looking forward to, because I want to get the full experience when actually playing it first time. Which comes back from the days I grew up in, Understood. which is the 90s and the early, yeah, like late 80s, mid 90s. Yeah, basically mid nineties where I got my if first PC. If someone is still alive in there, it is our duty to try and help. I think I can handle Before that. Before it was like a Super Nintendo. <laughs> yes, I certainly. Someone's lying there. And there also, you, you just went into a store, no, bought the games. Sometimes we never knew what you were getting. Legionaries on our way to Vladivostok. Let's pay attention to the game. We wanted to buy supplies from your mill, but found it burning. Who did this? Bolsheviks. They demanded we hand over our winter supplies in the name of Lenin. My son refused. We have a family to feed, he said. So they killed him. And the children. These soldiers are all the same. Killing and saw, you know. Just leave and let me die in peace. If the Bolsheviks wanted food, why did they leave the sacks to burn with the mill? was never about the food. This is what you get for refusing to collaborate with the Red Army. The Reds who burned this farm may not know we are here, but we can't wish. risk the train. Find a good spot to scout the train track ahead. This if there's it. trouble, at least we'll be ready. Okay, we also got our regular commands. Understood. Oh, we got a silent mode, nice. I'm on my way. I guess they are sneaking then. We also got the attack move, probably also. Okay. Understood. This might be machine. Oh, yeah. If I switch around, I actually see other stuff. Let's have I'll a look. take a look. As you wish. Looks good. Can go there. Yes. Send someone with so we also got that active ledge. skills. Now, we Captain. can heal each other. This you also gives off a little bit of cover. a commando flare. Yes, yes, sir. Look, it's the Reds who killed the Miller's family and burned everything. They deserve to die. Stand down, soldier. The Red Army will answer for crimes against their own country folk, but not to us. We are still in Russian lands and have a long way ahead of us. We don't want to be making enemies. Not to mention causing diplomatic incidents that endanger our new republic. <sighs> Enough chatter. Get back to the train. Maybe we can find more supplies on the way. Yeah, on my way. Oh, this is nice. This already gives this um Understood. feeling of claustrophobia. Assuming position. You're not in your homeland. You don't know what I is own. awaiting you or will be awaiting you. And you got a ladle. Understood. Uh, let's stop with the silent mode and move a little quicker. Our soldiers haven't seen action for a while. How about some target Priority practice on the there. scarecrows? On my way! They're not scarecrows. They're stuffed witches. <laughs> Watch out yes, for sir. Baba Yaga, the <laughs> mother of all witches. Less talking, Take more shooting. If Keanu Reeves was coming around, we would be F. Let's be honest here. <laughs> Engaging! <laughs> Yes, sir. Also, as far as we know, we didn't kill any dogs yet, so we should be fine here. In I'll take that, Baba Yaga. 
Understood. Moving out. Is that one of ours? Yeah, I guess so. They look Awaiting pretty orders. friendly. Orders? Finding cover. We legionaries leave no one behind. Bring the whole squad here before giving the command to leave. Okay, so far so good. A little introduction. We are also getting experience, so I guess we also got some RPG and upgrade elements. Let's see if I missed something. It doesn't look like it though. Nice. And we found some food and some clothing. As you and the others board the train empty-handed, the discussion ensues about the recent events. Some feel enraged, some uneasy. You are lost in thought about the experience of being in command. Major Gazdik, Gazdik grabs you by the shoulder, snapping you out of it. You did well, Captain, but you should stop bragging and start playing the role you hope for. Today you learned the bread and butter of commanding. Things never go the way you imagine. <coughs> we shouldn't should not have just let the rats leave. They should pay for their actions. Killing people, stealing and destroying food. Our provisional government said we should avoid conflicts. We cannot go around passing sentences as we see fit. We need to follow orders. The situation was affected because Maximilian Rep was has trait intelligent. Okay. Interesting. Maximum value of intelligent increased by one. So did he get one intelligence? Maybe. 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 I don't know. I don't know. Seems to be something you figure out on the way. Look what they do to their own people. What do you imagine they will do to us when we actually face them? Considering we are a seizable military force in their country. Will, while civil war is brewing. Sorry. What is wrong with my reading skill today? We have to be neutral. We are soldiers and we need to follow orders. Think about the consequences if we caught them red-handed as they kill civilians. So I guess we can make decisions here, but I'm gonna go with the neutral approach. Either way, I bet they would scatter if we faced them. They would be thrilled to see us there. I bet they would tell everyone how Czechoslovak legionaries shot an honest miller and his family, burned the mill and let the food and left the food to be destroyed. Shall we proceed to Moscow then, as planned, or are we expecting trouble? We will go to Moscow. Moscow, Moskva, to pick up my future advisor, Captain Langer. He is currently working to negotiate our safe passage to Vladivostok. Let's hope the negotiations will bear fruit. Indeed, speaking of fruit, since we did not manage to replenish our supplies, we will stop at the next station to do so. Dismissed. The journey begins. Go to Sud. Sukshinichi to get more supplies for the long journey. I'm so sorry for butchering these names. Alright, we got a nice world map. That is our train. I think as far as I saw on pictures, you can also zoom in in the certain elements of your train and have a closer look. Maybe even controlling your troops. Um, let's actually have a little look around and do a quick pause. We got our hospital cars, we got two soldiers healing, even though I think they are just maybe on duty. Uh, we got an infantry car with two guys, and we can assign them to living spaces if we would like to. Ah, okay, I think... Okay, we basically can put soldiers around, but I'm... I mean, we got more cars, so... Oh, yeah. I think this is like if maybe some people dislike each other or similar, you can just move them around between these cars, maybe. Free up a little bit to let the heaters, uh, the heated personalities rest a bit from afar. Let's actually just uh, split it up a little bit to not have it too crowded. We got an artillery car. Also, a machine gun post. Do I want people on this yet? Maybe. I make it the maybe. Okay, hmm. you also got your indicators of, for what the people are actually doing. We got several people that are not assigned to certain jobs yet. 
And we got our locomotive. As far as I saw it, there's also different kind of locomotives you can get and maybe end or unlock. But let's continue for now. Maybe speed it up a bit. The train stopped several dozens of meters before the station. There's another train blocking your pass. As you and others exit the train, you are greeted with grave silence and a few rifles aimed in your direction from near the station. Towards you, a tall red army officer is walking, accompanied by two soldiers. Greetings, legionaries. My name is Adam Morozov, who is in command of your unit. Major Gazek steps out of the train, shakes Morozov's hand firmly. You glimpse his other hand resting on the hilt of his trench knife. A sure sign he smells trouble, and you know he is rarely wrong. Major Otaka Gastik, I am in command of this train. To what do I owe the pleasure, General? Morozov betrays a look of mixed amusement and satisfaction. Evidently unsure if the Major has recognized his rank by his insignia on his uniform or through his reputation as the hero of the Great War. A mere coincidence, I was visiting family nearby. Nonetheless, our encounter is most unfortunate, uh, most fortunate, <laughs> as I have a proposition, one of mutual interest. What do we want, Morozov? Do tell. I am all yours. Indeed, that is how it should be, my friend. Because it is in my power to ensure your safe passage through Russia. That is what you want, is it not? All you need to do is hand over your weapons. Give up our weapons to you? I don't think so. You would probably use them to shoot us and then burn the entire station to the ground. You are not the first legionaries to pass through here. Your countrymen handed over their weapons without incident. For your soldier's sake, do as I ask or you will regret, regret it. Oh, I am sure you intend to let us be in our merry way, completely unscathed. With a full belly and a happy heart, I have set my peace, General. Start shooting or get out of my way. It is your choice. Morozov stares silently at Gastic. A few legionaries shift uneasily and unsling their rifles, which until now had been shouldered despite the obvious threat. Then Morozov slowly raises his hand and smiles. There is no hint of deception in his expression. He seems at least almost pleased. I appreciate your candor, Major. I think we both know where we stand. Until we meet again. With a polite nod, Morozov turns away and followed by his soldiers, he boards the red the train and departs. Everyone is a bit rattled. The departure of the train reveals the station. There is there a disaster. Journey begins. Go to soon. Okay, we got that. Proceed. Start the mission. Okay. We got artillery available. And let's see. We can create a squad. Interesting. Okay, so are they actually in the squad? Do I need to drag and drop them? Okay, for some reason. This is confusing. <laughs> or maybe this is the folks I assigned, or maybe I shouldn't have assigned them. Hold on. Am I just clicking at the wrong spot? It's not the right click. Sign to the squad. I think now we are getting somewhere. There we go. Should probably take some people that are resting and or unoccupied. Uh, let's take these bunch of fellas. Looks pretty good. Rifle scout. Yeah. Looks like we got everything needed. Deploy. Yeah. Something's wrong. It's too quiet here. Move out, but keep your eyes Ready. and ears open. Moving out. Sorry for being a little slow there, but also need to figure out how this is supposed to be working. 
As I said, I'm really liking this game. I mean, the, the Great War itself is also something I'm really interested in, historically. I think they need help. I'm ready. You live. Ready, sir. So yeah, I'm actually completely sold on this game. Yes, I'll see to it. Let's see what's there. Yes, I'll see to it. Moving. Awaiting orders. We're Czechoslovak legionaries on our way to Vladivostok. Can you tell us what happened here? The Red Army came for recruits and provisions. We told them to leave, but they just laughed and took whatever they wanted. They killed everyone who resisted. We saw trucks full of artillery shells driving towards the river. My sister lives there. I'm worried sick. Please, help. We came here to trade for supplies, not to get involved in Russian affairs. But the Reds attacked us before, and they are clearly up to no good here. We simply cannot risk the train. So we have to go and find out what is going on. Looks like they sabotaged the bridge. We'll have to fix it to cross. You can find tools and materials in a nearby camp. Right over there. I'm living right, right there. In Mm, where is that camp? Moving. This should be up here. Now ah, we probably don't need to be sneaky Moving. at the moment. <coughs> I'm listening. <coughs> um, so, oh, yes. taking everything back. Let's get in cover. I didn't Changing expect location. enemies to be this close. Engaging. Ready as I'll ever be. Taking cover. The Unus controller would be really nice. I appreciate that. I'm wait, assuming position. Not sure why that one jumped out of just cover scary. just yet, but... Yes! I'll see I to just it. not, not just yet. <laughs> oh, there's even Your close quarter sir. cover. Let's quickly heal our people before I'm we keep yes, moving. Sir. I'll see to it. The enemy seems to hold a good defensive position with full cover. If we don't have the range or grenades, we'll have to storm their position. Yes, sir. I think we got both of it, actually. Where's Ready? my sniperino? Assuming position. I'm there you is. are. I'll take a look. Engaging. Can you actually shoot him? Or can you not? Maybe you just Assuming don't position. want to. Say the word. A better option, yes. Here will do. I'm okay, I'm going. Let's actually try to keep him busy with these two fellas. Understood. And flank him. There I'm we go. Taking yeah, cover. Yeah. Great. Right, it worked just ah! fine. Finding cover! Yes? This place is crawling with reds. We should consider remaining undetected for as long as possible. Just please make Save sure no one fires by accident. Yes. Gunshots are not very stealthy. Mm -hmm. So hopefully when you go into silent mode, it also means they are not Finding shooting. Cover. Enemy spotted. Yes, oh certainly. Let's see. Softly does oh, it. Oh yeah, nice. I'm wait finding cover. Yeah, this Enemy actually spotted. gives off a lot of commando flair. Changing location. Okay. Rest in hell, comrade. As I'll ever be. How can I do that? Tactical view enabled. Okay, maybe I got detected. Finding cover. Uh, let's the get word. behind here and these behind here. Let's see. Uh, you could, by the way, activate that with the space I'm bar. Hmm. Changing location. I'm also thinking about. Ready? Well, not, that one. not the medic. I would like I'm to have the position. infantry do. Yes, this one. Your orders, sir. And I'm actually gonna try to I'm do listening. this I'll rather do that one. simultaneously. Yes, moving. He won't see it coming. Oh. So maybe that actually works. Good. Oh, yes. Now that the nasty business is done, right, let's see how bad the situation is. 
I'm ready. Defant, found a repair kit. We've got what we need to repair the bridge now. Yeah? Taking cover. What wounded soldier though? Hey? That doesn't look like a wounded soldier. <laughs> but I guess it means like if I got wounded soldiers, I could heal at that car. If I understand that I'll properly. Not a problem. Our medics are also engineers. Yes, Who would sir. have known? If there's a I appreciate that. Around, we should capture it to get a better view of the surrounding area. Old moving. You know what? Maybe I'm just gonna set this one up. Here will do. For a little defensive zone. Listening's understood. And I think if I get this yes. one into the tower, that already should be Not sufficient, right? How the hell do I get into the tower? Okay, I just need Ready to stay inside there. Most certainly. Is there still an enemy? Why I'm not capturing it? Um, yes, sir. Say the word. Yes. Definitely not. Okay, I'm not exactly yes. sure. Maybe it has to be Your orders, sir, all of my soldiers, position. even though I wouldn't say that makes any sense. What is it? I'm here. Man, I'm not getting it. Maybe I need a certain soldier type to capture the tower, but that Moving. also would be kind of strange. Oh, certainly. Also, Ready as I'll ever be! Okay, now, ah, I must not be in the silent orders, mode. Okay. Sir. So I'm not allowed to be in the I'm silent waiting. mode to capture. I'm waiting. That's Enemy something spotted. we have to know. Those position. must be the trucks used to transport artillery shells. We must stop them. There's nothing a yes. grenade can't stop. Let's, Let's see. Make sure we're not too close when they explode. Probably should be trying to come in from Ready. this side. Oh, this is my guy. Okay. Pull the pin, toss the egg! Assuming position. All quiet for now. Yes. What the coincidence. That bridge <laughs> looks perfect for an ambush. We should not proceed until we figure out what could await us on the other side. Does anyone have binoculars? Yes. Actually, oh, yes. Is there anything else though here, or can we just proceed? Uh, I think Changing we can location. proceed. Ready Where is my buddy? Be. I'll take a look. I'm here. Understood. Oh, actually, Sir? I also got another scout over here. I'll take a look. See. Enemy spotted. That's a lot of them. Oh, they know we're here. They'll be coming for us. Yes. Okay, I'm going. Let's set Ready. up the machine gun and give them hell. Ready? All righty then. A better option? Yes. Here will do. Orders. Here they Hopefully come. we are Stand just your fine. Hopefully. Awaiting okay. orders. Now we don't want to yes. do by a charge. Here, keep yes. it. Right home. Oh, crap. Finding cover. I guess I set it up, bro. Deploying. What's it? Taking cover. Fall back, please. I'm what the hell are you doing? What the hell am I doing? <laughs> That's just a scratch. Yes. I was about to say, didn't I have more? Why is that? Engaging. I don't know why the, the MG wasn't shooting. To be fully honest, us. after watching their buddies buy on the bridge. So let's call in an artillery strike and make those bastards let's pay for their strike. crimes. Okay, how do I? Ah, there. I like that. I like that a lot. Where can we do them? I'm not sure how the artillery strike is gonna. Oh, oh. Nice. If it is ex uh, like exactly on spot, or it's a little bigger. Nice. Blow. 
Nice. We came here to get supplies for our journey. Let's get them and leave this place. I appreciate what was just happening. I feel bad Even though I don't have a freaking room. Maybe. The Reds must have stolen is it because it was still in silent mode? It was so dumb. <laughs> I guess it is. I guess it is. Yes. You're I'm not blaming said. the game. I'm blaming myself here. So Don't get me wrong. <laughs> when I said I was so done by me, like by me, Take not by cover. the game. Mm -hmm. As you say, sir. Be right there. Yes. I'm all ears. Is that? Do I get to keep what I find, sir? Good. Fuel is the most precious resource on our journey. Isn't food our most precious resource? Oh, of course. At the next depot, we should buy a locomotive that runs on berries. Understood. Maybe we can yes. also burn berries to keep warm on the Moving. train as we cross Siberia. Righto. I'm not sure all of that sucks and is needed. Thank you. We'll be headed deep into Siberia and... And winter is coming. Carry on. <laughs> Yes, Winter sir. is coming. <laughs> nice pun there. Assume yes. Oh, I sort of picked those Ready. close up. I'll pry it open then. Finding cover. Let's go. I wonder if they got like a oh, find ammo. Is there On still my some way. Ammo? Did I miss something? That is the question here. Orders. Maybe Moving. let's. Move some of them back, some keep going forward. Yes, sir. There's them. That. See? Expected Orders, something sir, like that. Finding cover. I somehow expected something like Whoever that. Whoever left all this ammo behind must be very proficient with the bayonet. Well, yes. if my machine gun runs out of ammo, it's dead weight. Taking position. I just call for artillery support. Yes, I'm going. I guess the guys that are running away count as partisans Ready. or something like that. They're not I'm really listening. Yes. Or they join us? I don't know. Maybe they also join us now. Let's head back. We got some experience again. No level ups yet. Uh, sadly. I got some injuries, unnecessary injuries to a certain degrees. Oh, I can assign a medal. Um, where's my machine gunner that didn't shoot here? You get a medal. You did so great. <laughs> now this one gets a medal and... Oh, nice. Ah, I get it. The medal also gives them straight out XP. Yeah, I like that. Actually, you did pretty good. You get it, man. Okay. Three promoted to level two. That can't be bad. A little bit of a review of the mission or resources. That's some nice equipment gained. I mean, at the moment, I don't know what it's used for, but obviously, stuff like that is pretty straightforward. I mean, it was not used for the regular stuff, which might be for crafting and similar. Back on the train, the soldiers discussed the confrontation with Morozov at the station, as well as the violence in Reds enacted against unarmed villagers. Most, though not all, feel the artillery strike on the Reds encampment was justified. Major Gustek is lost in thought. I think the Reds were expecting us, setting a trap perhaps. Why I do not understand is why and why now. Isn't Captain Langer conducting negotiations in Moscow? He is, but we do not know the outcomes of these negotiations. Everyone get to your posts, I have letters to write and the train is not going to get us to Moscow by itself. Dismissed. Storm on the horizon. We are still on our way to Moscow. We got three new legendaries that we picked up in the last mission. Nice. And back to the world map. We got three idle soldiers. We promoted. Okay. I'm not exactly sure if there's something actively to do with those promotions or if we just should keep going for now. Probably just keep going. 
I feel like we are still somewhat of a... Yeah. In the tutorial phase? You have been called into the office of Major Gustick. Captain, as you are aware, we are low on some of the critical supplies. We got some in Tsukchinichi, but not nearly enough and we have a long way to go. There is a village ahead called Kaluga. Send a squad there and have them buy more food and herbs, if they have some. Yes, Major. I'll send the squad. If you, Is this about having a good time? You know, like... No, no, this is a serious topic. <clears throat> no 420. <laughs> Send the squad to a nearby village to buy some resources, mostly food and some medical herbs <laughs> and clothes for the bandages. So do we... Do I need to... I think I need to stop myself, right? As it's not connected to the railway... Oh, he has a broken bone. Poor, poor dude. Let's actually get him out of the squad hole. Edit squad. You gotta go, sadly, buddy. And we actually... I think we are gonna take all of these fellows in. Oh, nice. Um... Control burst. Burst count is lower, but chance to hit is increased. Let's actually take that. And we also have the suppressive fire. Let's probably also take that. Head down. Nice. And silent steps. Movement sound is silenced. That means I guess we can also run with these without getting detected. Maybe even being able to charge enemies from the back or something like that. That's interesting. Yeah, so far so good. The rest is pretty much busy with their assigned tasks, so... Let's go. I think this game might be actually pretty fucking awesome, if I may say it so. <laughs> Your people have arrived at the village and are meeting with the village elder. Welcome soldiers, what brings you here in these trying times? We have come to trade. We need food and herbs, the medical ones, to treat the sick and wounded. I see. Well, I am afraid I have to disappoint you. The boys of the Red Army have already taken away well, all the extra food we had. Military requisitions, they said, for the good of the states, you see. You can visit Ilja store. He has a good lad. Uh, he is a good lad. He will have something you could use. Mm, we can also... Ask more about the Reds. Let's do that, actually. Ah, one of one would think that everything would calm down not the Great War is over, but they recruit and requisition like they are getting ready for another war. We do not hear much here, but I am worried. Okay, sounds like unresty times. Let's have a look at the merchant. Um, So what were we actually coming for? We needed the medical herbs... I was about to say, is it is it like 1,000 for one piece? No. Um, so I guess we need to trade here. Let's take some herbs, maybe 20. We're still good on coal. How's the wood looking? Okay. Okay. And the metal is the most precious. So maybe... Ah, there, okay. I was wondering where. No, hold on. Ah, that's a deficit. I was wondering, like, um, you know. There we go. Yeah, yeah, that's better. 18, what is worse? 18. Let's give him one piece of wood and see. Okay, accept the trade. Let's just uh, try for the, uh, let's say, sheets and giggles to see uh, if he actually also denies the trade. If I just randomly 
He did not. Oh, I paid for it then. Okay, 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 okay. Now I get the system. Now I get the system. I bought way too much. <laughs> okay. No, no, no. Okay. We good. We good. We good. <clears throat> Nothing to see here. Just uh, get back to the train. <clears throat> Hold on. What? Wait. Are you guys not returning? Ah, I got to. Okay. 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 I got to manually send them back. I missed out on that part. So we know there's a trading post here. That is nice. Um, I think I would probably now have to tell the train to keep moving, which would make a lot of sense actually. And there also should be another settlement. Maybe we can check those also out. Also, there's a huge fire. Maybe that's a secret or something. Actually, when we reach this point, I'm gonna do a little tour. Oh, no, 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 not very fast. Just out of insurance, I really wanna send out another squad. And just have a look over here. Oh, they're still going. No, never mind. Never mind. Just go back to the train. Okay, I guess you have to have a preset spot to actually send them to. That's kind of sad, actually. So they could maybe explore a little bit. Well, then never mind. Let's continue on our way to Moscow. Suddenly, a loud metallic clang echoes through the air and the train begins to slow down. It seems the engine has broken down. You see Major Gustav coming towards you with a frown on his face. Damn thing broke down, Cap. Assign some workers to fix the locomotive so we can continue to Moscow. And there's no point in waiting aimlessly for the repairs to finish, so let's take advantage of that. Send a squad to look for boss supplies. We have got a long way to go and we need to make the most of every moment. I hope we do not have any more surprises today. I do not have a good feeling about the meeting with General Morozov. What are you waiting for, Cap? Get to work. Foraging. Foraging. <laughs> All I did is send the squad to forage for some food. Oh, nice. There's a lake, a forest. Uh, let's head to the forest, actually. Okay, let's see who we even have to do that. Hold on. He's in the artillery car. I guess we don't necessarily need that now. Locomotive towing wall, machine gun post. Yeah, let's pull him over. Where is he? Cannon post. Mm. Let's actually <sighs> giving them two shifts probably isn't the greatest thing to do. They might dislike that. <laughs> Just let's go like that. Oh my god, I was in full time. Okay, the engine is already moving again, so kind of wasted my opportunity here to just go out and forage a bit. But um, hold on, I think I should still be able to do that, right? I should be able to still move with the train, right? Like on the same height, maybe that they got a shorter way to return. Report, Major. We've searched the area and gathered what was usable. Oh, he's a trained herbalist. Nice. Oh, and someone ate some poisonous berries. Great, idiot. <laughs> it's 
so he's ill but we got 50 berries and uh, 50 herbs basically and also some food that is awesome um let's head back to the train and let's also send them right over there just gonna take this one out I guess he was not the trained herbalist if he was the one that ate the berries. <laughs> and stop. Let's do some fishing. Oh, they need two hours for that? Okay. I mean, understandably, the fishes do not come easy into your pouch. At the moment I'm really enjoying this game, I have to say, there's so much to be discovered. Um, the basic story is awesome, just because it's based on real stuff happening in my opinion, it's really interesting. Uh, let's have a quick look at the report. The lake was full of fish, unfortunately we had no way to catch them. Why are you even trying that? <laughs> we tried using a wire and a spear and as a last resort attempted to shoot some, but we were only able to catch a few. Okay, well. <laughs> No to ourselves, we need some fishing rods. Let's go back. <laughs> and let's see what awaits us in what awaits us in Moscow. And after that, I'm probably gonna cut it out at this point. As a first impression, I think we already saw a lot. I'm definitely gonna get this game when it comes out. I don't know about you, but oh, let's. Immediately a fighting mission. Ah, oh, okay, 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 okay. Do we have any unresolved stuff though? Doesn't seem like it, right? Not really, but I think I need a bigger squad for this. Thick black plumes of smoke rise to meet storm clouds over at Moscow is on fire. Through the pouring rain you can hear gunfire. Major Gustic moves from car to car, pulling senior officers aside from a briefing at the rear of the train as it slows for the city station. Alright, as you can see outside the situation is not good. There is fighting in the streets of Moscow. It is nothing short of civil war, but we have our orders. We must go in and meet up with Captain Langer and his unit. So we are to locate Captain Langa and then depart Moscow together. This is this should be quick and easy, right? Let us resemble the squad and go into the city. Do not underestimate the danger. One stray bullet, we will be in the middle of a bloodbath. And for God's sake, do not shoot first. We don't want to make things any worse. Is that clear? Dismissed. As the senior officers fall out and shuffle past, Major Gustic grabs your arms and gives you a familiar, reassuring look. You will be fine, Captain. Sign some soldiers for the mission. I trust your judgment. Have them locate Captain Langer as quickly as possible, but keep your wits about you. I am expecting trouble. And this is where it gets tricky, because I need more soldierinos. Mm, they recommended eight, we got seven. Perfect. <laughs> Let's have a look. That train is heading right for ours at top speed! Damn it, the Reds mean to ram us! Legionaries, break yourselves! Ooh, that's not good. General Morozov, I had a feeling we'd meet again. You are a liar and a coward! How so? Wreck a train of soldiers on their way home when there is no war between our nations. Allow me to remind you that I gave you an option, Major. Lay down your weapons and you may cross Siberia in peace. More than fair. And the offer still stands. Minus the train. Now, order your unit to surrender. You know I will not do that. Loyal to the bitter end. I respect that. 
May God rest your soul, brother Gazdik. That filthy coward. Yet, Captain Lanker, he must have a way to get us to Vladivostok. They've murdered Major Gazdik. We can't let this go unanswered. Yes? All right. And actually, I would like to make the cut at this point. Uh, just because the video otherwise is getting way too long. I hope I could raise your interest in this game. I think it's pretty awesome. It's on my wish list, and at this point I'm pretty sure I'm getting it by 100% actually. I loved it so far. And I think there's also a lot of interesting stuff to be discovered ahead. I hope you also enjoyed. Hope to have you back for another video. Have a great day. Let me know what you think in the comments down below or smash or maybe unsmash <laughs> now please smash that like button or dislike button whatever you prefer have a great day and goodbye